welcome back to my channel if you're new here hello my name is Twee. thank you guys so much for tuning into this video as you guys can see from the title your girl has been shopping i literally opened up my wardrobe the other day and i felt like i had nothing to wear the typical girl mindset even though my closet is full of clothing but i feel like now that it's autumn winter there's just so many things that i didn't have in my wardrobe and i just wanted a little refresh you know so your girl has been shopping i went on to misguided and i literally ordered everything from casual jumpers to more cute play suits more cute dresses for the party season coming up my sister is also here at the moment so she might pop in and say oh bitch take that off that looks crusty you don't look good in that but she's gonna be coming and also rating the outfit telling you guys what i need to do what i need to wear with it so it's gonna be a really really fun video i haven't done a video of my sister in ages it feels like so if you guys want to see all the stuff that i picked up please keep watching <laughs> Hey guys, it's the first outfit. Come on, sister Homalina. Ooh, I like the vibe. Do you like it? I like it. A little sass, a little bit of hoochie mama. <laughs> yeah. But the baggy jumper brings it like a little notch down. Okay, so me and Chanel is making a reappearance. But can Chanel show her OOTT as oh, yeah. well? Oh yeah, she's got the sexy doggy <laughs> nappy on. <laughs> that big booty is contained. The first outfit is this little number right here. This is from Misguided and Jordan Lipscomb. So she's mm. a YouTuber and she collaborated with Misguided, which is really cool. I really like it and I love it when it's like really slouchy here. Yeah. And then it tightens down at the wrist. So it gives a really edgy vibe. The only thing about it, so I feel like it's too oversized. But I feel that you have to wear quite a high-waisted trans with this, yeah. otherwise it can look a bit funny. Even this is not high-waisted enough, it's too big for me, but you can literally see my belly button. These shorts are from Windsor, and also how cute are these boots? I love that they're like ruched, they look really like nice and casual. Yeah, and they're like a good height for this as well. So I love it when it goes slightly below the knee, because so it makes it look a bit more like casual, yeah. you know, not like a thigh-high boot. But these are from Public Desire. Really sexy. I see a bit of ass cheek showing on the, the side. Are out. <laughs> I don't know if you'll get away with this in the UK weather, guys. Yeah. Like, it's winter over here. Exactly. But yeah. it's really cute. I like it. Oh my god, I should wear my big white jacket. So, whenever I get a jacket and it says oversized, I always go down because I want it to be a little bit more fitted. But. Oh my, oh my god. god. Jenny from the black. That is so bougie and classy. And the thing is, if you can see the texture in real life, it's really good quality so fur. Thick. I can see that my foundation's gonna rub off here. <laughs> That's the only bad thing with freaking white clothing. Yeah. But this feels so expensive and so luxurious. Yeah, of course it's like faux fur, guys. This jacket was like £100, which I actually think is really good yeah. for like a really long, thick jacket it like oh, this i agree when you're going clubbing and you wear this you look really elegant i wish it had something at the back though like a little belt or something just yeah. to like give it a bit more shape i also want to mention i love the length of the jacket as well yeah. sometimes when you find sort of these fur jackets sometimes it ends up at like three quarter length and i prefer it when it's much more longer and glam and this actually will keep you really warm as well it's really nice and thick okay time for the next outfit do we like this i like it this is the next outfit <laughs> Hello, detective. <laughs> this is not what I imagined it to be. So this is the Sophia Richie collection in collaboration with Misguided. I imagine that to be so much more edgier for some reason. This is the exact outfit that she had on the photo. But do you know, sometimes I feel that with these photos, they create illusions with like the wind blowing and yeah. there's certain posing. But in real life, I don't know, I just feel like it looks a bit... A bit cheap. Yeah, it looks a bit cheap, doesn't it? For the right occasion, it would look really cute. If you had really tall shoes and your hair was like slicked back or wet or something like that. I personally feel it's an overkill with the trousers. Yeah. If you were to wear it without the trousers and show a bit of legs or something with it and yeah. make it like a sort of like a dress coat and it looks like, ooh, I'm naughty inside. Oh, yeah, I've got nothing on, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Hello, open mm -hmm. for surprise. <laughs> friend Ling actually wore this to my party I'm and she wore it as a jacket. It actually looks really, really nice. I think together it's just a bit too much in your face, I feel. Okay, let's try without the, the trousers. Whoa! Keep the camera rolling. Close your eyes! Go oh, for a pull of my knees. <laughs> 
but do you know how I like to tie belts like this? So I would a double loop it down here, like go back like this, mm -hmm. and tie it as a knot, and then pull it out. So oh. it makes it go like a more hourglass figure with a oh. jacket like that. That's a good idea. You know, the tactics that I always do is I always safety pin certain angles to make it stay like this. Yeah. So you're always showing a little bit of leg. Yes. Whenever I have like big events and I need the slit open, my sister's so good with safety pins and she hides them so well. Whenever I do, you can see the safety pin. Like, <laughs> I think it'd be quite nice as like a dress, but it's one of those outfits where you're gonna be hot in it because I'm literally like sweating at the moment. Yeah. I think the trousers will look cute by itself with like maybe a little boob tube top. Yeah, a little bralette or something. Okay, this one is a thumbs down for me. Okay, who are you come in now? What do you guys think of this one? These shoes are from Ego Official. They're so cute. They're like little sock boots. I feel like I'm in Cheryl Cole's Fight For Your Love music video. You gotta fight, 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 fight for your love. Okay, who are you? Okay, what do you think of this outfit? Let me see it from the front. This is the back. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> this is that an eyeball. <laughs> I was not <laughs> expecting that. So these whole trousers are sheer. The top is a completely different top. They are not like a co-op. Oh, so they're not. They look like it is, you yeah. know, this fabric and this fabric look very similar. Yeah, I chose it because I thought it would be really nice together. The only thing is when I was on the website, I thought that these pants will have pants built inside it. Oh. So when I tried it, I was like, oh, <laughs> I was definitely surprised. Is it really see-through? Yeah. <laughs> Two cheeks out. <laughs> Why do you think it actually looks quite cool? Yeah, it's quite sexy. The thing is, I feel the pants is a bit too boxy. I like it to be more of like an hourglass like that. Or is it just your shape? <laughs> <laughs> it might be just my shape. But I think it looks cool. Yeah, yeah I like it with these boots as well. Yeah. These boots are really cool. With this, I would probably wear like a bodysuit or something. That's a bit more... It's not fun. Yeah, not a fun. <laughs> <laughs> not this. Brazilian panty oh, okay. kind of. So it's not like a full on granny panty. It's like... I would have gone for the granny panties. Okay? Really? Oh no. Or you could even wear like little shorts or whatever. Yeah. It it's cool that it's got a pocket. So this is also from the Sophia Ritchie collection. She actually has another trench coat that matches this, but it was sold out. I really like this top though. Oh, yeah, I think really the top nice. is so nice. It actually is quite cropped as well, which is nice. Sometimes when you get tops like this, when you tuck it in, it's like so much fabric. Mm. But this one actually tucks in really, really nicely. Yeah, it looks good. I yeah. think it looks edgy. I like the sleeves as well. It's got a really long cuff at the sleeve. So it makes all this bit like puffy. I'm really into these sleeves at the moment, guys. I definitely agree. I love like a puffy arm and it has to be like tight and yep. cuff here i think it just looks so sassy and edgy like. yes even if you don't wear these sock boots it has a nice cuff right by your ankles as well yeah. so yeah guys we like this outfit i rate I like a good it. like eight yeah. out of ten i think the only thing me if i was designing this clothing i would make this a bit more high-waisted because sometimes i can feel like it gives you a bit of muffin top <laughs> i'm so critical <laughs> guys i would love to help to design like clothing yes we need to put this into action guys go at pretty little thing for us <laughs> guys let's see what guy thinks about this okay what do you think about this outfit it's nice you like it yeah the fuck? <laughs> the ass boy. <laughs> okay, who are you? you? can come in. Oh, I love this. Do you like this one? Oh my god, there's no pockets! No! Oh, this is like Christmas vibe here. I, I think really... this would look really nice if I had a matching blazer. Yeah, I really like this. And the thing that I love about this fabric, it's glittery, but it's not actually physically glitter. Yeah, it's like embedded inside the material. Because yeah. all the time, whenever you wear stuff like this, it's like so annoying because like yeah. sparkles everywhere. It gets really messy, but yeah. the quality of this is really good. Yeah, a little bit of glitter does come out, but not loads. And yeah. it's not one of those itchy, glittery materials either. Oh, okay, so it's quite comfortable. Yeah, though. it's really comfortable. It doesn't feel like scratchy on your legs or anything. I love the detail on this because I love it when it's like flat here and then it's got ruching at the back. Yeah. Because sometimes you can find that when they ruch it all the way around, it doesn't look flattering on your waistline. That's when you get the muffin top. Yeah. This is really nice. If it's really true to size, this is actually from the petite range. So I got the top in a size 10 and then the trousers are in a size 8. Yeah, but I really like it. I think it's so sparkly. I thought that it wouldn't be that sparkly when it came in real life, but it actually looks really nice. This, I would love to wear this for like a Christmas party. Oh, yeah. I think it would look so much better, yeah, if there is pockets here. Yeah, I know. It's just like, why would you not put fucking pockets in? It's so annoying. Yeah. And the thing with pockets at the side as well, I love the illusion that it gives like a bigger, like, hourglass waist and hips ratio. I literally feel like I'm the fifth member of Little Mix. <laughs> I'm not going to go on stage. Like, 
I love the contrast of something really covered up down the bottom and then you're wearing something really revealing on top. I think it really balances it out. I love it like here, but I think going out I'll just feel a bit self-conscious. Oh like, really? Too much skin, I think. And I'm going for clubbing, I'm like, yeah, I need a bit of fight in there as well. <laughs> Where would you wear this to? I would wear this to a Christmas party, yeah. yeah. I don't know about a work Christmas party, but like if I'm going out trying to catch myself a man, yeah. this would definitely be the vibe. I like it with these boots. I yeah. haven't ever worn these boots out and I've had oh, them really? for like a year now. I I think it looks really nice. I love the shape of the boot. I really like it when you get like big loose pants and then you have like a really tight ankle. Mm. That's like one of my favourite things. So even if you don't wear the boot, it's quite cuffed at the bottom anyway. So you can just wear like strappy heels if you wanted yeah. to show a bit more like toe or anything like that. Yeah. I think this would be so nice if it was in nude. Oh my god, maybe we need to bring out something like this in our clothing line. <laughs> Coming your way soon! Maybe! <laughs> oh my god guys, I literally nearly fell and broke my damn ankle. Oh my god, these boots! I don't know how I feel about this outfit. This is very risque. Oh my god! <laughs> this is very raunchy. It's, it's a bit too much for me. Yeah, I yeah. feel like the top should be covered up or something. These shoes are so cute. They're from Public Desire. The only thing about the shoes is that I should have gone true to size. I thought I'd size up because I thought the boot would be like too small. But I got them in a size five and they're like too big. So I definitely need to like wear some thick socks. I literally went like this earlier and I <laughs> nearly snapped my ankle. But that's what happens when you wear platform though. I feel platform, you can be like on the edge of things. I don't know, for me, I would wear something baggy on top more classier top because i feel that this is quite raunchy you need to kind of taper it down do you feel like this top looks better with it oh i like it i think this looks so much nicer it looks like classy and edgy at the same time this is what i like yeah i think it brings a really nice balance to it earlier on i think you just showed a bit too much flesh for yeah. my liking joe guy just said what's up with girls clothing these days get skimpy and skimpy <laughs> <laughs> Just like this cutting and this bit, it's still sheer, but it's still sex and classy. I really like it. You will definitely catch yourself a man in the street. I also got the boots in a more PVC black, which I actually think will also be really cute as well. If you had like a full black outfit and these heels, oh my God, look how hot these heels are. This shirt is from Boohoo, by the way, guys. I literally love the color so yeah. much. And I feel like this will go with a lot of outfits yeah. as well. And I love that it's like a really low cut and you tie it there. I can imagine it going with so many different styles. I no, I thought this would look nice with jeans, white jeans, you wear it with like trousers as well, like cigarette trousers. I feel that if this came in white, I think it would like make it step up a notch. Yes, I love it. Ooh, I really like this. Yes, I didn't actually plan for this outfit to go together. I actually really like the flares. I think this is a different type of flare, you know? Because it goes tight and tapered in and then it flares out. I actually have always wanted these type of like slinky trousers because I feel like it looks really flattering on i actually really like them i'm surprised i thought that it might make me look quite fat but it makes your booty look good yeah your booty looks really good from the back it gives you a really nice hourglass figure from the back really into these flowy kind of tops but this top is kind of like a bit different i don't know it's kind of like a corset kind of detail here yeah. which is also really in at the moment i like it and i love the shade and the pattern on it yeah i actually think it really goes well with the black trousers as yeah. well it looks very romantic from behind it looks really nice i really like it it looks really tapered here and then yeah. it gives you more of like the hourglass figure it's so cute yeah oh my god i actually really like these trousers these trousers are so cheap as well i think it's only like 10 pounds or something what shoes do you think would go well with that i think i need something really tall because it's so yeah. flared i think this gives you really long legs my yeah. sister's already got fucking long legs but it looks even more elongated. I think these trousers are actually from the petite range. Oh. So it's a little bit shorter. I can't even imagine if you got like the regular one, it'll be like a freaking a whole chain. <laughs> and I also quite like that the sleeve cuts in, but then there's also extra mm. fabric. Good choice. Mm. I'm impressed with all the choices that she's made so far. Okay guys, so I think that's it for this haul, but I want to share with you guys some accessories that I picked up. Mm. Miss Guided has some really, really cute accessories. I love their belts, I love their earrings as well. I really like belts that are really stretchy like this because it really snatches you in at the waist. I love belts that there's not a buckle. Yeah. I feel that sometimes the buckle makes you look more chunkier. I don't know, it just gets in the way. When it's just like a little clip on like this, it looks like it's seamless. The only thing is, I feel like this it's belt- a bit big for you. Yeah, this doesn't fit me, What size did you get? There's only one size in this, which oh, is so annoying. That is annoying. And I feel that with these type of belt, I like it to be even more tighter yeah. because it gives you a really nice suction. This is 
how big it is yeah, on me. It still I has quite really a lot. Big. So I don't know what we're gonna do. We're gonna have to like add some extra buckles or safety pins, something up in here. Yeah. Obviously, I wouldn't wear this belt with this outfit, but I just want to show you guys what it looks like. There's not that many belts out there on the market, guys. Things that I would change about this belt is obviously the sizing, and I would love to see this wrapped all the way round. Yeah, I don't know why they all stop it here. They're trying to be cost efficient, girl. And then we also have this belt, which is also very, very snatched. Oh my god, this I so love this. It looks really expensive. And me, black and gold goes with like everything. That is my theme for life. I actually quite like those two separate kind of belts. It's a bit yeah. different, actually. I actually quite like the belt with this outfit, actually. It makes me feel even more snatched in this belt actually fits me but that belt doesn't but i love the black and gold kind of detail and this kind of like print it reminds me of like Givenchy. Givenchy? Oh, okay i was thinking gucci <laughs> gucci the hell kind of gucci you got this, this is, is definitely fake gucci yeah, yeah this is like a fake designer i actually quite like to online when i see it in real life i'm like oh it looks too big and chunky i think it would be a bit nicer if it was a tad bit smaller yeah it's too big like it needs to be a lot smaller what i also like about it is that it's got one strap that goes as a crossbody and then it also kind of loops back like this and then like it comes backpack yeah but i like the fact that it kind of goes into one like a little triangle and i love like the gold details on it but when i touch it i don't know i'm not keen on the fabric and the yeah. structure to be honest with you yeah so i like it when you like sling it around one shoulder or when it's like really loose but then it looks a bit weird with this dangling down isn't it that's because you need to take this off you don't wear it's it so annoying time. you can't have like it both at the same time but i think i would prefer it like a crossbody though it kind of reminds me of like a fake Gucci Louis Vuitton situation, you know? It's a bit too long for my liking. I would prefer it like if it was a bit yeah. shorter. Damn it. I'm always on a hunt to find the perfect bag, guys. Mm. Okay, guys. So that's it for this haul. I hope you guys enjoyed my sister's company. Please let us know if you guys want me to film any other videos my sister. This clothing haul, this is what I got a haul for you guys. <laughs> In my pyjamas. <laughs> so yeah, my sister's here cleaning it up for me today. So I thought I'd get her on camera because she mm. hasn't been on my channel for ages. I know. And me and Chanel. She's just making herself comfortable down here. We enjoyed this little session, actually. Yeah. I love, like, hauls and everything. I watch it all the time. Okay, so what was your favourite outfit? What was my favourite outfit? I'm trying to remember all the outfits now. She fucking forgot fucking. Really. What was your favourite one? I actually really like this one. I would actually wear this one. And I actually really like the black with the thong ass. See, I really like that pink top that you had earlier on. Because I'm really into that organza material. Okay, guys, so that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And let's go wrap up this video. Okay guys, so that's it for my clothing haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Also see my sister appear in the video as well. Her little commentary is always so, so funny. Even though she's a little bit annoying, but you know what I'm saying? You guys always want to request her in the video for some reason. So Miss Guided have actually been so, so kind and they've actually given me a discount code for my followers. I don't get any commission or anything like that. It's literally for you guys, if you are shopping this season and you're picking anything from Miss Guided, they've given you a little code. So I'm going to leave it here and also in my description box. I'm also going to leave the links to every single item down below where it's from. If you guys want to get direct links to anything, make sure you click on them because Grand takes ages doing the description box, okay? So don't let that shit go to waste. Let me know if you guys like this haul. I can also film some more if you guys want to see like New Year outfits or anything like that i definitely can film a video for you guys so yeah let me know what you guys want to see and that's it for this video guys i will see you in my next one bye guys enjoy the bloopers <sighs> shimmy 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 guys you like the decoration that we've done in the background we've done a bit of christmasy vibe freaking <laughs> hell man <laughs> she just told me not to wear my contacts <laughs> okay <laughs> okay i'm closing my eyes dun, 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 dun. <laughs> 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 the monkey almost falling off the train. <laughs>